this is our home. I can't believe I'm, I feel like I'm in a dream and I'm going to wake up. I don't feel like, you know, it actually happened to our church. It appears that one of our uh, refrigerators that we use, we have a very small refrigerator, either the refrigerator, the cord to the refrigerator, or the extension cord uh, caused an electrical fire, which was limited, again, to that one room, extensive fire damage, but then the smoke and the water damage and the breaking of windows, etc., went throughout the entire church, and the smoke damage and the water damage is devastating. We're in the middle of a very large uh, iconography project uh, within the church and um, all the icons that were placed on the wall are destroyed from fu either smoke damage or heat. I told my husband, let's, let's go. He said, what are we going to go do there? You know, what are you going to do? There's nothing you can do. I don't think they can let you in. And then I just got dressed and came anyway. And then when I saw all the parishioners crying, and then I came in and I saw the church, it's horrible. Nothing survived uh, the immense heat and the fire, except one icon of St. Nicholas, which we take as a small blessing and as a small miracle that... We're protected, we're prayed for, and we're blessed. We're blessed by this saint and by God and by our Lord and Savior.